What's up, guys? This is Leo and the Technician. Oh, what's your name? I like that. <laughs> the, the Technician. We got Leo and the Technician. The Technician. And we're doing like a it. Pokemon Crystal Nuzlocke. He doesn't know anything about Pokemon. Well, he knows about Pokemon, but he doesn't know as much as I do about Pokemon. So I figure this is going to be a fun experience. My Pokemon knowledge extends to what my kids do. That's it. All right, so are we a boy or a girl? I think we're Let's men. Do yeah, let's do men. I think we're men. Yes. You sleeping, huh? Hey, what? You woke me up? It's like the beginning of like every Zelda game. Really? Yeah. I think it's more like the beginning of every um. At least every uh, other Zelda game. Maybe like you know, Wind Waker, not Wind Waker. Um. Oh shit! What time is it? Oh, it's uh, five twenty-nine. Okay, so five twenty-nine to date the time that we're doing this. So it's, it's almost gonna be night because this game it, it turns night at six. Oh. Because they don't know about daylight savings time. They do actually. They actually mention it. Five twenty-six, or no, it's five thirty. It's five thirty. Damn, right on that. Wow. Yeah, because I overslept. That was me today. <laughs> ah, hello there. Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. <laughs> People call me the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited by creatures that we call Pokemon. People in Pokemon live together by supporting each other. Some people play po play with Pokemon. Some battle with them. What do you mean by playing with Pokemon? What are you trying to say, Professor? I don't even want to. <laughs> <laughs> but we don't have anything, everything late. We don't know anything about Pokemon yet. There are still many mysteries to the solve. I thought he was going to say discover. Uh, you know what? This is a lot like elephants for the Nintendo Wii. Elephants. Elephants, E L E B I T S. It's a, it's a game where you live in a world where there are creatures, but the creatures are all electrical. And they use them to power like their electronic devices, their game consoles, their houses. And then do they really battle with them? Yes. Nintendo. I know, right? You're reusing your things again, Nintendo. Alright, we need a name. Um, so we gotta pick a funny name. Uh, alright, alright, how about this? How about this? You pick a syllable, and I'll pick a syllable. Crap. Uh, crap, that's <laughs> a <silly>. crap. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I was gonna I was gonna say So we'll go crap. Crap. I was gonna say cheat, so. Good old crap cheat. Crap cheat! The Mr. Garper crap cheat. Crap cheat, are you ready? <laughs> Your very own Pokemon story is about to unfold. You'll face time. You'll face times and tough times and tough challenges. Yep. You'll face times and tough challenges. Times and tough. Cha is that what he said? Was that yeah, he said times and tough challenges. Times. So are we being timed? I don't think we're being timed. You sure? I think so. Okay. All right. So here we are. That pixelate itself. Oh, Game Boy. It's Mom. Oh, crap sheet! <laughs> <laughs> oh, your dad was making a joke when he, when he fucking named you that. Uh, El was, Professor El was looking for you. He said he wanted to you to do something for him. Now, wait, Mom. Mom, what are you, what are you trying to do? What are you trying to do? This is family friendly. This is supposed to be family friendly. What's going on here, Mom? Oh, yeah, yeah. This is, no, this is Gen 2 for people that don't know. This is Gen 2 for Pokemon. This is right after Red, Blue, and Green. Oh, okay. And yellow. So this is directly after that. I remember yellow because they had to. Uh, I had to yeah, the Pikachu follow you. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that was like one of my favorites. Uh, so this was when they they first gave you the option of a cell phone, so traders could call you up. They'd be like, hey, you want to battle again? Really? Yeah. Oh, today's Sunday. Yes, it is. To date, today what we're doing. So look, this is. Oh, day hey. So you know, watch this, watch this, watch this. So what time is it right now on your phone? It is five thirty-three. Five thirty-three, right? Look at that. The time kept going. So, oh, that's brilliant. So if you... So Nintendo. If, Nintendo, you do something hey. right. You do some things right, Nintendo. So are they... Uh, see, he... We are like... What? Ten? 
And we have cell phones at 10 years old. Yep. My 10 year old ain't got no cell phone. Some 10 year olds don't need cell phones. I don't think any 10 year old needs a cell phone. Yeah, not at all. My 13 year old, I didn't have one. I didn't have one when I grew up. So. I didn't either. Before cell phones weren't around, we had to use stone tablets. <laughs> Hey, you chucking at people. That was texting back in the day, kids. <laughs> Alright, so this is the Pokemon Sauce. I played this game personally. I'm the Supreme Ultra Master, but I've never played a Nuzlocke of this game. Okay. So, for those of you at home that don't know about Nuzlocke, here's okay. a brief, brief rundown of the rules. Rundown. Future Leo, I need you to put the rules up as I list them up, okay? Please. So, rule number one. You can only catch the first encounter Pokemon in a given area. So if we go out to one area, and the first Pokemon we see is a Rattatat, guess what? We got a Rattata. Awesome. That's gonna suck. That is. Because <laughs> we get, we're gonna end up with some Pokemon we will fucking never probably use. Right. So that's gonna be fucking grandtastic. Number two, if a Pokemon faints, he is dead. Okay. You cannot bring him back to life. There is no Pokemon Centers. There are no healing. If he dies, you take him to the Poke Center and you release him. It's a permadeath. Yes. Okay. Permadeath, he is dead. We cannot use him. Thank you, Dark Souls. Pretty much, if you run out of Pokemon, if you, like, black out, mm -hmm. all your Pokemon fate, you lose the Nuzlocke. Oh. Nuzlocke is over. You lose. Okay. Uh, well, in a given area, and I say if we, we, first area we go to, we catch a Rattata. Mm hmm Next area, if we encounter a Rattata, a Rattata again, we do not have to capture that Rattata. Because we oh. already have him. Okay. So it'll be the first and newly encountered Pokemon that we already don't have. Gotcha. So no repeats. No repeats. Gotcha. Otherwise, we'll go through this game with like 40 Rattatas. That's not going to work. No. No. Okay. And then, uh, uh, fishing is a different story. Wait, so, so like, if you, yeah, you can fish with Pokemon. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you can fish with Pokemon. So, Pokemon found in the water and Pokemon found in the grass are two separate, separate Pokemon. Right. So, we get, in the same route, we can catch one in the water and we can catch one in the grass. Okay. The first encounter for both of those. Now, what about like the, the ghosts and the darks? And there's no, there's no. If we encounter him first, he, we can catch him. Okay. Because there's in this game, there's Pokemon that show up at daytime, show Pokemon that show up at nighttime, and oh, yeah, it's kind of, it's gonna kind of. It suck. went back this far. That's when the cycle started. Yeah. Gen two was when that started. Then Gen two was also when they started with the days, like. Okay. And it kind of sucks because you can meet Pokemon, different Pokemon, on different days. Like you can catch Lapras in this game, but it's like on a Thursday in some cave you have to go to at 9 a.m. or some crap. Yeah, who's going to be going to a cave on Thursday at 9 a.m.? A 12-year-old kid with nothing better else to do. Only a daring summer. Stay in school, kids. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so I think that's I think that's all the rules. I think that's Fair all enough. the rules to a Nuzlocke. All right. I think that might be all the rules. So, now uh, we're going to get our starter Pokemon here. Now, we're going to have to think long or hard because this starter Pokemon... Oh, I forgot. We have to nickname every Pokemon that we catch. Every Pokemon that we catch has to have a nickname. So that way so that way you can develop bonds with this Does Pokemon. Does that be family friendly? I mean, we can't just name them fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> oh, it has to be a little bit more creative than that. <laughs> fuck face, I choose you! <laughs> Like no, when, when I was a kid, we used to we used to name the main character Fuck, comma I. <laughs> so anytime something like Fuck, I caught a pigeon. <laughs> fuck, I beat the gym leader. It is hilarious. <laughs> it is wonderful. Oh, that's brilliant. I love that. All right, all right. So for, so for Gen Two, we got these three right here. We got Cinequil, the fire type. All right. No, we're going we're going through. Yes, yes, mother. Yes, we know. Okay. And then I think this one's Total Dial. Total Dial was the one I picked when I first started. Total Dial was a punk in the cartoons. Yeah, no, he wasn't. Total Dial was the one that danced a lot. Yeah, but it, <laughs> no, before he got captured. Oh yeah, he was a punk. Oh, he was a punk. Okay, so then and then Chikorita, the grass type. So we gotta think about this one longer and hard. All right, so what are the pros and cons of all? Uh, let's see. Well, grass type. They. Hello. Testing one two three. <clears throat> okay, there we go. This is the voice of future Leo again. I am sorry to have to do this yet again, but the idiot that you're watching right now, past Leo, forgot to do one crucial thing. He didn't make sure that the camera system was recording all the footage. So now, you guys have half of an episode. <laughs> 
whereas the other half is lost. I don't know how many episodes are like this, where one half of the episode is present and the other half is not, but I digress. So, for this short period of time, until the video's over, I will be putting up random pictures of random things. Pass Leo is an idiot, yet again. I apologize for your inconvenience. I think Chikorita is a tank. She, so she's good with special defense and defense. Really? Yeah. She's good at special defense and defense, and her special attack is supposed to be good, but other than that, she pretty much sucks. Her regular attack sucks. Oh. Total Dial, I think he's supposed to have a high special attack, maybe? Or, the reason why the technician is here is for his handy daddy Pokedex. All right, so let's take fire out of the equation. Take that fire out of the equation. Just okay. water and grass. Well, okay. <clears throat> if Chikoria's normal attacks are horrible, but she's a tank, that means she can withstand a lot of damage. Yeah. I mean, so, with that being said, she's less likely to faint. Now, that being said, I don't know about the stats of... I think Totodile has a high high amount of stats, like for attack, attack-wise. So, but uh, how's his hit points? It's probably... He might be the glass cannon. Glass cannon? Yeah. I'm familiar with that term. The glass cannon means, like, you can deal out terrible amounts of damage, but... You get hit twice and you're gonna die. You're okay. you're favoring attack over defense. Okay, so I guess um, with that being said, as a player, do you prefer attack or defense? Generally, uh, attack. I, I'm, I'm an attacker. Generally, when I'm an RPG, I, I I'm all about the attack. It's the first thing I beef up. That beef up my magic. So total dial. Total dial this. We pick a total dial. Total dial. I choose you. All right, we're picking total dial. So we gotta give him a nickname. So. Mm. All right, so he's a water crocodile. Right. A water crocodile. What would we name a water crocodile? Um, you ever played Banjo Kazooie? What was the fucking crocodile's name? Oh, dude, make me maybe look that up. Was it Snapper? Could be. I think it might have been Snapper. But Snapper sounds pretty fucking good for an alligator. I like Snapper. Let's do a Snapper. Snapper. His name is Snapper, guys. Hey, I like Snap, Snapper, or Toothless. All right, welcome back. We had a little technical difficulties there, but now we got it all ironed out. We picked Totodile. His name is Snapper, and he's a fucking gorgeous Snap Snap. Snappity Snap Snap. Snapper is the bomb. And we're going to go all the way to the fucking Pokemon League. Totodile. Here we go. Number 158, Water Type. That's really all the information you're going to give me? Seriously? Lucky, you can't come over here. My dog Lucky, guys. Dog Lucky is trying to come over here. Uh, here we go. Low HP, th uh, fairly good attack, fairly good defense. Special attack kind of low, special defense low, and speed's kind of low, too. Height, two foot. Weight, 20 pounds. Weight's 20 pounds? Mm hmm. Weakness against wa electric and grass. Makes sense. He's a water type. All right, so now this doesn't count because we don't have Pokeballs. We don't have Pokeballs. So this is pretty much Pidgey. Uh, and see, this is the this is the gen where they made a move when you encountered them. Oh! Snapper's gonna destroy Pidgey. All right, Snapper, you scratch. What's up, guys? This is Pass Leo. Uh, a lot of crap happened with this Nuzlocke. The first episode of this Nuzlocke, we lost a gang of footage. Uh, so I want to apologize beforehand because I'm just going to give you guys the abridged, rush, ber, the abridged version right now. So pretty much, uh, we picked Total Dial, we named him Snapper, uh, we went on the route, or whatever, we fought, ooh man, we fought a lot of Pokemon on the way there. Um, we made we made it to the second town, Cherry Grove Town, the guy gave us the map, uh, then we went up to Mr. Pokemon's house, Mr. Pokemon gave us the egg, and the, uh... Professor Oak was there. He gave us the Pokedex. We went back down. We fought our rival. We picked the Chikorita. We went and gave the the egg back to Professor Elm. And he uh, was surprised or whatever. So we went. We found our journey. We named our freaking... We named our uh, our rival Aslan. We thought that would be hilarious. Uh, and after that, we went and caught our very first Pokemon. Our very first Pokemon was Hoot Hoot, Mr. Owl. And then after that, we went to the route right above that route, and we found a Rattatat. We wanted a Geodude, but whatever. And we named him Ratfink. Uh, after that, we went on, off on our journey. 
and kick some serious butt. Uh, we power through a lot of the stuff. We pretty much grind it for the first, I don't know, like 10 minutes of us being newly revived or whatever. And yeah, uh, that's where the episode ended. Uh, so the next the next gameplay will not be like this. Uh, we I actually double checked. The second episode's footage is complete and ready to go. So yeah, you guys just had to sit through this crap for a minute. So once again, I apologize, and I hope that you tune in next time for another exciting episode of Never Lose Nuzlocke. This is Leo, past Leo, signing off.